We'll guide you through how to set any song as an alarm on your iPhone. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This is super useful. First of all, make sure you've got the song either in the Files app or synced from your computer in the Music app. If you don't already have a song, you can go and download one. For example, I'll go and get one from this website here called Pixabay. I'm just going to filter for music. I could scroll down here and listen to these different songs and I can download them by pressing the download button over to the right and it will be downloaded. After you've done that, we are going to go and need an app, but it is by Apple themselves and it's called GarageBand. Here it is. You can then go and open it up like so. What you want to do is click on the plus in the top right to go and create a new project. Swipe across until you find audio recorder and click on it. Now, what you want to do is go to the top, just go to the right of the red recording button and click on it so it's not blue. Then you want to go to the top right and click on the gear or cog icon and in metronome and chime in, go there and you want to go and just switch those off and head to the top right and go and click on that plus like so. Where it says section A, you want to go and change that to automatic like that. And then what you want to do is head to the top left and click on those broken three bars like so, and it will go and switch to this here. Now what you need to do is go to the top right and click on the loop icon. And now we can go and find songs. So what we can do is go into our files and we can go and browse from the files app, or you can go through your music. Make sure it's synced from your computer though. In this case, I'll browse from the files app. And this is what I just downloaded in my recents. You can browse it as well. Go and click on it. It should then appear in this list here. And what you need to do is go and click and hold on it like so, and it will go and add it in. I'm just going to pinch to make it a bit more visible so I can see more. What you can do is go and hold the start point to go and adjust where the song starts and click, hold, and then position it where you want it to start. And you can go and make adjustments. And what you can do once you're finished is click on the line in the top right and go and click on my songs. You can see it's my song 18. Once it's finished, hold your finger on it like so, and you want to go and click on share. You'll get this pop-up and we need to save it as a ringtone. Don't worry, we can use it as an alarm. Just press continue if it doesn't need to be adjusted and we can then go and name it and you can go and export it. You can then go and click OK like so and come out of GarageBand and we can go and open up the clock. We'll go and create a new alarm and for sound, you can then go and see it here. I named it My Song 18 or I've got it selected and I can then go and set an alarm. If you found this useful, then leave a like.